the concluding words of the Bhagavad Gita. Yatra Yoga. Yatra Yoga Shara Krishna. Yatra their way are. Yogeshwara Krishna. There were these higher values represented by Krishna. Yatra Partha. There where man is. Partha represents you and I, the individual members in the community. Dhanurdhara. Not that go slow. Ah, work, work. Sluggish, slumberous, inertia. Even if you get a job, work is hammered. But why did you work like that? What else is wrong? I am sorry. I am sorry. Until at last the whole country is sorry. Because everybody is sorry. Think of it. That alert. Vigilant, ready with the tool of life, ready to act. Not merely saying that Swamiji, I am ready to act, but uh, tomorrow, next month. Is it? Procrastination. Yatra partho dhanurtara tatra deya. There where there is Krishna representing the higher values of life and Arjuna representing the dynamic readiness to act in the world outside. Tatra there. Shri prosperity. Vijaya victory. Bhuti Progress. Dhruva Niti. Niti policy. Dhruva Niti. Firm, steady, progressive, creative policy. Matir Mama, this is my opinion. Meaning, I am not asking you to accept it. But this is my opinion. Mere readiness, physical level. With all the modern equipments is not sufficient to create prosperity and joy in the human community. I mean, you are all lived through it. The last war clearly showed, is it not? Hitler had shown it. That armed to the teeth a whole nation of determined youngsters. Ready to make enormous sacrifices. They could only ultimately break down the moral core of the world and bring down humanity to the present state of valueless existence, confused and confounded. Think. Pure philosophy. Subtle, subtle philosophy. And everybody going to the Himalayas, sitting in utter meditation, that tragedy of the Hindus in India would happen historically. Everybody sitting back, only saying it is all proud of the... Alexander has come. Never mind. Proud of the... Uh, Muslims have come and ruling over the country. Never mind. That is all happens. Bhagavan will protect you. Go in the Akshana, Akshana, and in the name of the Krishna take a little more prasadam. <laughs> that is all. That's purely spiritual. You cannot live in this world. Purely materialistic and secular. There is devastation and disaster. Spiritual values and higher principles in you 
and we are all ready to work for the benefit of the country and the society. Cultured people, healthy in their values and ideas, when they work, that nation or community shall have. See that second line? Shri, prosperity, Vijaya, victory, Bhudi, progress, Dhruva, niti, steady and righteous policy. Think of this 6,000 years before Christ. Today none of them is with us. Think. 36 years after independence. We have not got Sri. Prosperity is not there. Vijaya. <coughs> victory, victory or what? Election victory. Who the progress? Fifth five year plan. Finished. Progress, oh progress. No electricity. Right? Completely the entire industry is at a standstill in Madras for the last how many? Twenty days, I think, three weeks. And it's not going to end. Until the rain comes, let us stop it. Do you know the quality, the amount of waste of national wealth? One year strike in Bombay, old, dilapidated, last century's missionary was somehow the jogging along for the textiles of India. All those machines have corroded and none of them can open it. Who is going to suffer? Not the owners. Even if they sell it in scraps, they don't mind because that land value has come up that it is sufficient. It is not a nation that is going to suffer because nation always looks 20 years ahead. 20 years ahead, we will have new machinery, therefore production will increase. Who suffers? The poor people who struck work. Think how situations create and we man-made sorrows, not God-made. Sri Vijayo Bhuti, what I meant was, whether you are labor or labor union, union leader, or you are the managerial class, or supervisory class, or the top people, all of them must have value. But the cheap prostituting politicians of today, no values. They think that that is not necessary. Some other get the election. Ay, ay, ay. Then what? Then prosperity to me, victory to me, progress to my family, and a beautiful policy for my own aggrandizement. That is not the anxiety of Krishna or the anxiety of the Hindu rishis. What happens to a community? This last words of the Bhagavad Gita raises the status of the whole Gita. That it has got a message, political and economic, for the social survival, not of the Hindus, but of the entire mankind. This is equally applicable in, Fra I mean, in American uh, politics as well as in Russian politics or Chinese politics. It is a beautiful lesson for the leaders of mankind in all climes, all colors and systems.